My name is Richard Asiago. I'm 22 years. I'm a bodybuilder, a fitness influencer, and a personal trainer. And this is my fitness journey. So I started uh, working out in 2018, immediately after high school. I know you might be asking yourself, Mbona immediately after high school, Nili nifanya nikanda ku work out uh, immediately after high school. So I'll take you back to 2016. Uh, in 2016 I was in Form 2, and uh, kama kawaida mtu kiwa Form 2, you want to participate at uh, sporting activities, ama kitu activity to takupeleka inje at least. So unfortunately for me, I wasn't good at uh, these other sporting activities. I didn't work, uh, football, neither. Mambona. These other sports, I wasn't that interested. But I wanted to do something to involved in fitness, fitness. So I started um, in 2016 to be particular. So there was this day to land at home uh, from school. So, ilikuwa in the midst of the term. Actually, we ilikuwa in a, an era in the fee. We ilikuwa na fukuzana fee, so I took the opportunity because um, most of my friends were going home. And uh, of course, ilikuwa on a Friday and from school to home, it's only two hours. So, niko naacha nikijipeka weekend because we ilikuwa na era in the fee. So, klasicha kitana majina, niko na there's no need ya kumuambia tiku na era na my friends were going. So, kuenda home, um, uh, on that, Sinuwa nimeenda home on a Friday, on that Sunday, mi liku wanga nimezoya kutoka home around 12.30, ndio, my school had a policy that by 3 you should be in school. So mi liku wanga kutoka 12.30. So on this particular Sunday, my dad woke me at 6. At 6, na sasa, eh, hey, mi nika jam jusiko at 6. So he told me, amuka uwoge, u prepare, by 8 when you are going to church, na mimi ni nienleke shuleni. So, mini kamuka, of course, shimbo upande, nini, nini. So, in the process of wearing clothes, kitu kaniambia, um, what if you sit down, you just go to a gym, ubanga hizi for like uh, two hours, then uh, matemi yako ya kawede ya kwenda shule kifika, I just go to school. So, mimi in New York, hapo when you sit down, time, hapo eight, mini kenda kisit down. Kisika kisit down, ni kenda building in ito a market plaza. Nika ulizia, nika ambiwa, nika directiwa, jima hiko uko iltuoza on another building across the road but ukipanda penye bulls ilikuonga kitambo 2016. So that's where I went. So mi kuenda huko, nika pata train na mwenye likuwa. Kani uliza, I remember the exact words, the very exact words. Ali niuliza, mwanafundi, umepotea? So nilikuwa nimevua uniform. So nika kuwa like, apana, kani uliza ni kusaidia aje. Nika wambia nataka kufanya mazoezi. Kani uliza, uko na nguza mazoezi, nika mwambia apana. Haka niambia uwezi fanya mazoezi na uniform. So ni, ni kamuambia mi ni kona vest. So haka niangalia ukijana. Haka niambia na kwa changing room. Then you come here then um, I tell you what to do. So mi ni kena ni kachange. Ni karudi na vest yangu na short. Toja yangu ya shulea bado na socks. So I started uh, working. Haka niosha just the basics. A flat bench, decline bench, incline bench. Mambo na barbell curls, dumbbell curls. Just the basic workouts. So mi nilikuwa tunaongeza weight ni kitreni, 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 kitreni. So mi kushitukia na niambia, tiki hey, umetreni sana time baya, enda wakati wa huli daiso takuna kuja na kutreni. Eh, hey, mi kuenda kuangalia time, it was 1.30, and by 3 nilikuwa nafaka kufika shule. And it, from Kisitown to school it was 2 hours. Nika chukua bag, nika kimbia shule. So kufika shule, my friends were like, eh, hey, kwa numenda nyumbani siku mbili, umeka atafoti aje, juu. I trained so hard for like, we imagine kutoka around kuseme, wacha tu ni estimate kwanzi ya 10. Because kuseme kutoka Kisitown na adi home, my home ni Suneka, Kisi Suneka. So from Suneka adi Kisitown, kuseme 30 minutes, 40, depending na gari, kutafta gym, kuseme nilianza 10. So imagine your time, your daddy niliba emerge, I was training, 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 kuangeza to wait. So in short, nilikuwa na pump kwa mwili. So mabeshitongo likuwa like, hey, unakaje hivi umeungunga. So hiyo, hiyo kuchocho chocho na mabeshita, hey, unaka ume, umeongeza mwili. So it made me feel good because at, for once I was uh, good at something. So I made a promise to myself that wakati holidays I'll be going to the gym. So I'll, uh, kila mali hapa, ndakuwa nonisha picture ama video during my steps. So, um, um, 
venye nili nikaanza kwenda during the holidays but it was expensive for me because I nilikuwa na tumia pocket money ile ndio nimesend kiasi at school ndio nilikuwa naenda nayo gym so i made a promise myself to ilikuwa na nikalia very hard that immediately after high school i'll uh, start going to the gym so nikiwa form 4 ile saa ya kcc so on a games time teachers used to tell us that ni kwa do some uh, sporting activities ndio by the time you join in your class your mind is fresh so me during games i used to do push ups na kumbuka kuna time flani tulikuwa tunapiga nini eh, tunatumia mguu ya wheelbarrow kama roller to train the abs so it was a uh, short year duration nilikuwa na train train ile ndio yenye nilikuwa napata success card nimetumiwa na parents ni ni ile ndio unapatanga umetumiwa tumiwa saa ya KCC so ndio yote nili save immediately when I maliza to high school even the following week nikaenda gym so hapo ndo nilianza ku work out sports club na ilikuwa december 2018 around the school the, spe, the specific date but ilikuwa december 2018 so that was the beginning of my fitness journey so mimi nikaanza ku train sports club nilikuwa unajua i know you might ask yourself ilikuwa aje easy for me to pay for kwenda kiss sports club nivi by then kiss sports club ilikuwa under bopade na with time when you change wakaanza at per month uh, mimi nilikuwa nimezoeana na wasoko na walikuwa naona determination yangu so nilikuwa nalipa 500 200 by the end of the month napata nimemaliza kulipa katu k kangu so nikaendelea hivyo June then nilifika hivi nika join college hapo ndo nili join NIPS college so nikaingia huko kusomea journalism but kulikuwa na gym flani hapo Kimbo Gwa Pacific 14 hapo kando ya um, ni GSC ya Mareke Sport I'm not sure so kuna gym yenye huko 14 gym so huko ndo nilianza ku train venye nili join college i started training there nika meet some trainers so penye tumefika so far subscribe subscribe acha nikunywe maji i'll continue this story again once ya venye nime join college so until when i started my youtube channel okay so don't let to subscribe for now and then the last story in a in a few ni important sana kunywa maji because maji is very essential for the body and also while you are working out nipo keep fit na kunywa maji so nilikuwa nimeachia venye niliingia college nikaanza ku train kwa 14 gym uh, nika train train nika train for a while then covid hit 2020 venye covid il hit 2020 nikaenda home kisi so your duration yote i'll tell you all what i used to do nikiwa home during lockdown because gyms zote zilikuwa zimefungwa hadi uko home kisi siko anaenda gym but i'll tell you what some of the workouts that nilikuwa nafanya kwa nyumba then zimesaidia ku keep at least siku lose sana mass yangu and everything and my strength do i'll do that in another video ni story ya siku nyingine so nika train train huko so venye nilihama during unaona venye covid ilifika ilibidi niamisha vitu so by the time i was coming back ilibidi ni, ni relocate kwenda place inaitwa Bokairo so huko venye nili relocate kwenda hadi 14 gym it was so hard so nikaanza kwenda gym flani ilikuwa huko opposite spam nilikuwa nasimama spam hall uvuke tu barabara street unaanza hiyo gym it's a small gym na hapa juu nitaka video ya that gym one when nilikuwa ma some pictures that I struck from my Instagram account so nika train train huko for a while like what gym fit kama i actually anyway that's a story for another day so nika train train there for a while for a long time and then uh, 2021 ah 2021 hapo kwenda mwisho something happened nika lose kilos nika in short i was broke a lot of things that like happened in short nili feel ni kama mwisho because hata nili cut mass unajua ku gain muscle mass is so hard nili cut from 64 kg to around 56 because i remember ni 56 because kuna siku kuliko tumeenda ku cycle with my friends hapo kimbo kwa tane kuna watu wenye wanapimanga weight hapo so mi best time wakapima ai mimi mimi nilikuwa naogopa juu nilikuwa naona eh juu nilikuwa nime cut sana kwenda kupima 56 nilikuwa nimeshuka kutoka 64 hadi mabeshi wangu walikuwa like hey richi rudi to gym one so nikaanza kurudi gym pole pole nini i started training best time flani alikuwa anajaribu ku cut weight so nilikuwa nampeleka gym alikuwa anakuja kwangu ananichukua so hiyo kitu ilikuwa na ni motivate kurudi gym nikaanza kurudisha mass because hiyo duration yote i learned a lot of things and i learned my body when in work 
so eventually when you open your gym or a branch karibu na place naishi so i started going there a 5 minutes walk nikaanza ku regain nikaanza ku regain mass yangu nikaanza ku regain strength so when 2022 january we hit let me tell you something mimi nikaanza fitness 20 nili fall for fitness so i wanted to start a youtube channel but nilikuwa na 50 50 nilikuwa na ngopa so january 2022 eh nika make up my mind because by then college ndio ilikuwa imeisha nini vitu mingi so i started nika nikaamua let me start a youtube channel na for those who are with me when i started my youtube channel wanaweza kubaliana that the first like 10 videos hazikuwa za hii gym zilikuwa hizo gym zenye nilikonga na workout kitambo you know? in fact penye nilianzianga hizo gyms except kisiani hiyo gym ya one for hizo gym start hapo ndo nili record videos but i had to delete those videos because of a reason or another i'll tell you that for another day so tumeshafika penye i started a youtube channel so i'll tell you on another clip story yangu ya youtube channel venye nilianza challenges venye nime face challenges as a bodybuilder as a personal trainer as a fitness influencer as a bodybuilding venye inachukuliwa you should embrace bodybuilding and you should embrace uh, kukua fit so that is our video for today remember to like subscribe i'll be uploading more and more clips zenye tunapiga story tunaongea each channel there's a reason nili call dream and there that's another video okay there's a reason i call this channel dream and there so dream about that body that you want and dare yourself to achieve it so guys see you in the next videos as we build big muscles